Hi everybody, welcome back. I'm Ashley and this is Martin Midlife Misadventures. Today I'm giving you a tour of the little pantry I put together for mom while we were in Arizona. Now keep in mind, we were sick like 75% of the time we were there. We did not have a vehicle, you know, money was an issue, all these things and we still managed to put back. Well, I'll show you. Check it out. All right, friends, this little armoire right here at mom's house is where I secretly have started her a little prepper pantry. Let me show you what's in here. And one thing I want to share with you is I was able to put back, since we've been here, 92,000 calories right here. Now, to break that down for you, if you were eating a 2,000 calorie a day diet, this would last about 46 days. If you're eating 1,500 calories, it lasts about 61 days. And if you're about 1,000 calories, which honestly is about mom because she's a teeny tiny little thing, this would last over three months. So here we go. Let me show you what's in here real quickly. I've got a 10-pound bag of sugar. You saw the pie fillings and a couple refried beans. We've got some canned vegetables, 1A1 sauce, some tomato paste, cocoa powder, some of that jet puff that we found. This container down here, we have two peanut butters in here, but this container down here has eight pounds of rice in it. We've got a container of oil. We did leave mom some of that milk that we got and some good old salt and pepper, some black beans, some uh, canned chicken and canned tuna and some more refried beans. If I move these, I've got some containers here. This one has five pounds of pasta, and up here are beans, same thing, five pounds beans, and in this one we have some brown sugar and powdered sugar, a 12 pack of chicken ramen, two five packs of beef ramen, some cornmeal, some coffee. We did get some non-food items, like sponges and some vitamins and that kind of thing that we left here for her as well as one of these things these disposable washed cloths oh I'm so glad these are here for her just in case and some tissues and some foil and down here I'm just I kind of stack things around things she already had but I repackaged um, some more rice like right here, we've got two pounds of rice in this creamer container. And I think I showed you guys these on another video, but this was mayonnaise, obviously ketchup, and a peanut butter container. I feel good knowing that the grains are packaged properly and she doesn't have to worry about uh, bugs getting in. Mice and things like that out here aren't a problem for her, but uh, we have one more thing to get repackaged. And I think she's going to have to do that because we are leaving at 3 a.m. in the morning. But look at that, guys. 92,000 calories. All right, friends. Not bad, huh? Over 92,000 calories. And that's perfect for mom for a little over three months. But if you were a big old working man burning those calories during the day, yeah, that's a little over a month's supply. And you need other things to add to it. I just wanted to share this with you so you could see. Just get started. Get out there and start buying things. Look for the things that will last long term that you like to eat. Mom loves peanut butter and her favorite bean are black beans. <laughs> she eats refried beans all the time. I just really tried to get the things that I knew she would need and like to eat, okay? She'll keep adding to that and rotating from it. So I'm feeling really good that we were able to do that. It gave me some ideas that of things I need to do for our pantry as well. Please leave us a comment. Let us know where you're at on your prepper pantries. How big are they? How long are you prepping for? How long have you prepped for versus how long do you want to be prepped for? Look, we don't know what's coming, all right? But we know anything could come to any of us at any given time. The comments that we get, the people who have shared their stories of job loss and illness and how their prepper pantry has literally saved their life when finances just were not there. Time was not there, but they had the food to eat. So, 
Just keep doing what you're doing, everybody. You're doing the absolute right thing. Please give us a thumbs up, like, share, and subscribe, and we're going to be talking to you really soon. God bless you all.